here is the holy bible you see this verse i quoted you now is to be found in the roman catholic version of the bible it is to be found in the authorized king james version of the bible is there but it has now been thrown out of the vice standard version of the bible Baby, you can call me a superman. Chuchu 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 ni taku mama. Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. It's your boy Jesse Keegan and your girl Fanny Gongo, and we are Funny, Funny Jesse. So right about now, we're gonna do another reaction. But before we get into the reaction, guys, we wanna thank everybody out there who've been subscribing to our channel, guys. You're the realest time we've been, man. Thank you, thank you so much. And also, we wanna thank all the people out there who've been actually, you know, giving us reaction videos. You also are realest MVP. So, um, as you know, like we've been, uh, you know, putting up some some uh, some posts on the on the community about our new channel and stuff like that. And if you want to support us on the new channel, guys, just go on the uh, on the comment section below. We've pinned uh, uh, our channel, whatever uh, link down there. Just go and you know click that link and please just subscribe to our new channel, which is called Finding Jesse 2.0. We really really appreciate you man if you just do you know just 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 subscribe or just take your time to check it out yeah take your time check it out if you like it fine you can subscribe, yeah, subscribe. and if you like it more you can put that notification uh turn you can, you can post yeah, notification. turn on the yeah. post notification yeah hmm? mm -hmm. yes so anyway guys uh, so today we're gonna do that another reaction but before we do the reaction guys um I actually decided to download uh, like like I told you when we were reacting to the videos I felt like I should read uh, the Quran or something like that like I should go deeper probably try to to learn and understand and read and whatnot so I decided to download the Quran I have it with me over here I hope nobody's gonna judge me or something like that uh, where is it I went forward and downloaded I think I got the best version online or something like that just let me know if if this is not a good fashion i just went and now what is this too much adverse anyway i downloaded it that's here i think those are uh, the chapters and uh, the surah what yeah the surah or something like that i downloaded it uh or maybe if this is the english version or if you know of any uh application that has the best quran um uh, uh, Rather, if you know the best application, yeah. you can Sorry. link it down yeah, below. Yeah, yeah. yeah just uh, do it and uh, I think it would be really, really, I'd be really happy to just, you know, read the Quran and stuff like that. And yeah, I mean, I just want to read and understand and learn about the Quran and stuff like that. I think it's going to help me and I think I'm going to go deeper into understanding of, uh, of, of, of the religion of Islam and stuff, and stuff like that. So anyway, guys, so right about now, we're going to do another reaction. This one right here was suggested by a lot of people. So many people suggested this one, and we can't just go without reacting uh, on this one right here. And those suggestions like we should go react to Christian get shocked after answer from Amididat. And this one right here was suggested by a lot of people out there, and they suggested that you know we should react on this one. And yeah, without any further ado, guys, let's get it. I'd like to know who has heard this verse? For there are three that bear record in heaven: the Father, the Word, and the Holy Ghost and these three are one have you heard that before have you heard that do you read this in your bible do you yes yes no my brother says he does read it you know you don't read it in the bible it's not there it is there yes and amazing that yes yes well there are three i'm quoting first epistle of john chapter 5 verse 7 where it says, first epistle of John, chapter 5, verse 7. Where it says, for there are three that bear record in heaven, the Father, the Word, meaning Jesus, and the Holy Ghost, and these three are one. You say it. In your Bible, sir? <laughs> Here is the Holy Bible. You see, this verse I quoted you now is to be found in the Roman Catholic version of the Bible. It is to be found in the authorized King James version of the Bible. It's there. But it has now been thrown out of the Vice Standard version of the Bible as a fabrication. The verse on the Trinity...
it is thrown out, it is thrown out as a fabrication. All modern translations of the Bible do not have that verse anymore. This is thrown out by not by Muslim scholars, Jewish scholars or Hindu scholars, but 32 scholars of the highest eminence, backed by 50 cooperating denominations. They found that this was a fabrication, and as a fabrication they threw it out. Similarly, 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 the ascension in the Gospels of Matthew, Mark, Luke, and John. You find ascension twice, that Jesus ascended into heaven. Chapter 16, verse 19, and Jesus was taken up into heaven. Luke, chapter 24, verse 51, and Jesus was taken up into heaven. Only two places in the Gospels is the ascension mentioned. My brother quoted from the Acts. The Gospels, Matthew, Mark, Luke, and John, the, word, the ascension is mentioned only in two places. And those two places also in the Revised Standard Version of the Bible, they have also been thrown out as fabrications. Yeah. Revised Standard Version of the Bible. Wow. What do you think? Uh, what do I think about uh, um, I wasn't really shocked as the title uh, says or something like that in the Bible we, we talk about uh, the Father the Son and the Holy Spirit yeah but uh, I, I, what 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 he was trying to talk here he was trying to bring out some contradiction yeah? what exactly or rather certain things that have been um, removed yeah. from all the Bible from the older, yeah. Bibles. From the older Bible. Because he mentioned about the Roman uh, Bible and then there's now the King James one. Oh, you know, there's, um, there's so much miscon uh, misconscrewedness or whatever word you want to use in the in the in the probably the modern day Bible that we have today. There's so much that has been edited. And I feel that what he was saying was the truth. I mean, as a Christian, as a staunch Christian out there probably, he might get shocked to hear certain things that, uh, what Amity Dad has, has just mentioned, because, I mean, not everybody knows about the probably Catholic Bible or something, but not everyone, yeah? Because, I mean, the generation we're in today is a generation that, um, is exposed to the New King James version. It's true. Yeah. So, like the King James is the new edition that most of the people actually like. Most of, the, not all of them. Most of the people actually follow it. Anyway, I mean, it's at this level. I mean, people should set standards on which Bible was the actual, uh, like, like published to 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 what like to to was published to uh, to not confuse people and be you think the King James version is better? No, I don't think that's better. I don't even think that the Roman one is even better. King James was the author, yeah? Not the publisher. I don't want to go into details about King James, but let me just finish up at this point. I think what Amididad said was really, really amazing, it was really good, trying to demystify the King James Bible and the Roman Catholic Bible, which is really shocking enough to find out that the King James one, there are some things that are not in there, which is, I mean, not not good. It's somehow deceiving Christians at some point, you know, because. But then the thing is, this video is just what two minutes long. Yeah, it's only two minutes long. So already one should ask what the question was, because it says yeah. the title is what Christian get shocked after answer from. I mean, did that. Yeah. So which, what was the question? And yeah. What was he trying to prove? Exactly. But then from this short clip, what we're getting is the fact that he's trying to show this existed in the older version of the Bible, but then when you look at the newest version, the King KJV, James. it's no longer there. Mm -hmm. So I don't know. Was he trying to say maybe the newest version is better than the old one or what? No, I, no, no. I don't think so. 
I think he's uh okay. Or I don't want to judge. Or maybe though, he's trying to show that maybe they're removing things that don't yeah. make sense from the older versions and trying to make it you less confusing so? in this new one. I don't know. I'm just thinking. To my own thoughts, I think. Because then don't why want to would like... King James version remove it? Remove the remove certain chapters. Not chapters, uh, verses. Yeah, you know that's why I said I don't want to go into 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 details about King James. No, but then we can't really but, go into details but because it's a short clip. Yeah, that's what I'm trying exactly. to say. Exactly. Yeah, we can't really find out what actually the question was and where it was headed to. But according to my own, like, just my own opinion, he was just trying to show that King James, they shot off. Of, uh, of some maybe verses and whatnot, and then maybe the Roman, whatever, Bible has more verses in there. Just like the earlier reaction we did, he said, okay, the Catholic Bible has 76 books, and this other one has, uh, is it 66 or something like that? So, what, I mean, he, he was just trying to show the differences, I think so. But now the thing is, if the Catholic has 76 and the other one has 66. What happened in between that period of time? You understand? What what made this these other books being probably removed or whatnot? No, sorry, these other uh, verses or something like that. There should be an answer to that, but nobody has the answers. And uh, I don't think even Amity that has the answers. Him is just here to probably try to tell Christians, you know, this is the book that you people follow, but look at it, it has been... Like, take note of the differences. Yeah, take note of the differences. So, which one is the truth here? Which one do you want to follow? Do you want to follow King James? Do you want to go with this, uh, the Catholic one? You get it? I mean, it's so confusing. Why? Islam, you can just go with only one Quran. There's no, this, that, there's no, that, that. You get it? That's what they're trying to demystify over here. Anyway, guys, if you feel like you reacted to this video, the better ways to give us a thumbs up. And don't forget to go down in our comment section, tell us exactly what you feel about our reaction and what you feel about uh, Amir Dad on this one right here. Just let us know in the comment section below. And the most important thing, guys, don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Then we keep on subscribing. Then we give us the motivation to do a lot of videos and to give us a better, better content. And last but not the least, we're going to see you in the next video. And peace out.